number one without using a calculator find the value of each of the following so we see here when we have factorial nampak tak exclamation this exclamation mark so if you have three it means that three times two times one so if this if this means from three until darab satu so five means five times four times three times two times one until we see one so this is how this thing works this this is what this symbol means All right okay so for a so a we have eight five so we know that eight means eight times seven times six times five up until times one right and then we know that five exclamation of five means five up until one so when you see this one you can actually cancel out this thing from five to one can be cancelled out from five to one see this one and this one is the same right this one is actually five times four times three times two times one and this one is actually the same so basically the same thing up and below you can cancel out so you are left with eight times seven times six so here we get So here for A can also be written as so you see here eight and five right so it's also eight times seven times six times five you see here when you just put five and exclamation that means another five times four times three times two times one which is similar with this one so you can directly cancel out so same with previously we will get three three six all right okay for B. So here we have it exclamation minus six divided by six. So you see here, you can directly cancel out this thing. Real, sorry, eight factorial means eight times seven times six factorial. I just want to stop up to here because you see here you have six here divided by six factorial. So you see here this one and this one. So this one is this one is the same. So you can take out six factorial out. So this one, when you take out six factorial, you are left with eight times seven minus. So when you take out six factorial out, it means that you divide with this one. So you are left with one, right? So up here, six factorial divided by six factorial, the same thing, you get one. So divided by six factorial. So this one and this one can be cancelled out. Eight times seven is fifty-six minus one. So we get fifty. Five. Okay, for C, so you have four factorial, and this one is two factorial, two factorial. So you see, a four factorial is equal to four times three times two factorial. I just want to stop up till here because you see here you have the same thing below here, which you can cancel out later. So this one is two, two right. So you can cancel out this one, right? So up here you are left with four times three, and two factorial means two times one. So here four times three is twelve divided by two times one is two, so we get six. Okay, so for D you have seven factorial, five factorial divided by four factorial and three factorial. So same thing. I want to cancel out up and below. So so you see, seven and five are both larger than four and three, so you can cancel out. So seven cancel out four, or seven cancel out three. You can do either one first. So I want to cancel out four. So seven times six times five times four. You see here, I stop until four because I want to cancel out four later on. And this one five factorial. So this one will be five times four. So here, four factorial can be cancelled out with this one, right? Now I want to cancel out three factorial, so times three factorial. So I stop until here, so that I can cancel out three factorial. See here. So you see here, both below here is being cancelled out. So above here we have seven times six times five, and this one we have five times four. So you can just use calculator.
So here you get 200 times times 20. So we get 4,200.